Auzubillahimineşşeytanirracim Bismillahirrahmanirrahim Last time we stop here now we'll continue this lesson inshallah Al-Wahdatul Khamisa 50 unit at ta'amu wa shara foods and drink Ad-Darsul Wahid Warbaun 41st lesson At-Tarakibun Nahviya Grammatical Structures At-Adribul Awwal First Exercise تبادل السؤال والجواب مع زميلك كما في المثال exchange the question and answer with your colleague like in the example المثال the example الطالب الأول أين الغداء where is the lunch الطالب الثاني الغداء على المائدة the lunch is on the dining sheet now you need to remember this question whatever is in the picture you will ask where is that thing then the second person will tell you it is on the dining sheet so you will close the uh, you will hide the example and then you will say Ain al fatur where is the breakfast and the second person will say al fatur wal al and the breakfast is on the dining sheet Ain al asha where is the dinner al asha wal al the dinner is on the dining sheet Ain al samak where is the fish al samak wal al the fish is on the dining sheet. Ain al dajaj, where is the chicken? Al dajaju al al maida, the chicken is on the dining sheet. In this way, you will do it without looking at the example. You need to hide the example first, and then you will do it. Atadribu sani, second exercise, tabadali suala wal jawaba mazami likama fil misal. Exchange the question and the answer with your colleague, like in the example al misal, the example al talibul awal. Maza ta'kulu fil gada. What do you eat in the lunch? Al talibu sani, akulu laham. I eat the meat. Then we have. Again, you need to hide the example. So you will ask him, "What do you eat in the lunch?" Maza ta'kulu fil gada. He will say, "Akulu samaka eat fish." Maza ta'kulu fil gada. What do you eat in the lunch? He will say, "Akulu dajaj." Maza ta'kulu fil gada. Akulu salata eat salad. In this way, you will ask the questions. What the third exercise is? Third exercise. How will come up in the example? Convert. Like in the example, so ya kulu mean he eats, and note here we have ya, which mean he, and in muzare we always use the ma at the end. Ya kulu. If you remember, in fele amar when we give command to someone, we use sukun at the end. So when we are preventing someone from doing something, basically we are giving them command. To not do anything. In that case, we will also use skoon with it. So when we add la here, we will use skoon here. It will become la taqul. But the question is, if we are using skoon here, when why kasra is written here? The answer is this: that because of this alif lam, we have skoon here. But because of this alif lam, we are pronouncing kasra. So here we will say la taqulit taam. So you need to remember one thing. First thing is this that when you will add la, you will use sukun. You will use jazm with fail muzare. And second thing, if the next word has alif lam, then you will pronounce kasra here. Same thing with all of them. Yaksilul malabis is washing the clothes. So you will say la. Malabis. Don't wash the clothes. Yaknusul Urfa. He is sweeping the room. You will say La Taknusil Urfa. Don't sweep the room. In this way you will do it without looking at the example. Yashrabul Halib. He is drinking the milk. La Tashrabil Halib. Don't drink the milk. Atadrib Rabi. Fourth exercise. تبادل السؤال والجواب مع زميلك كما في المثالين. Exchange the question and the answer with your colleague like in the two examples. المثال الأول. The first example. الطالب الأول. ماذا تطلب من الطعام؟ 
what would you like from the food a talib sani baad as samak min fazlik some fish please al misal us sani second example a talib a talibatul ula here we have female that's why i am saying a talibatul ula ma zata tulubina min at tam what would you like from the food a talibatus saniya baad as samak min fazlik some fish please so note for male we say tatlubu for female we say tatlubina this is the difference so again you will hide the example and then you will ask what would you order from the food maza tatlubu min at-ta'am he will say at baad as-salata min fazli baad as-salata ti min fadlik then she will ask him her she will ask her maza tatlubina min at-ta'am what would you like from the food and she will reply baad as-salata ta baad as-salata ti min fadlik then he will ask him maza tatlubu min at-ta'am he will say baad al-lahmi min fadlik then she will ask her maza tatlubina min at-ta'am what like what would you order from the food baad al-lahmi min fadlik so note the difference between male and female then you have the revision of all the sentences here you can skip this page then fahamul masmu understanding of what you hear atadribul awwal first exercise istame lesson summa dai rakma fil murabba il munasib then put the number in the appropriate box so here we have 6 so let's see what we have got here i think homework number is 12 let me check click on classes When go to al arabia to baina yadik then we will click on class work i think homework number 12 is already done by us so homework number 13 yes so homework number 13 has these videos so we will click on view assignment then we will play the video If you feel the speed is fast you can slow the speed by click on place back speed and you can decrease the speed of pronunciation Al-wahda al-khamisa At-ta'am wa al-sharab Ad-dars al-thani wa al-arba'u Thaniyan fahm al-masmu' At-tadrib al-awwal Ad-dars al-thani wa al-arba'u ثانيا فهم المسموع التدريب الاول استمع ثم ضع الرقم في المربع المناسب واحد انت سمين جدا انت سمين جدا this is the dal picture so here in the dal one i will write واحد Here I will write one. Next, it. It's not. Ahmed yakul samak. Ahmed yakul samak. In the first picture, we see he is eating the fish. So I will write it's not here. Anta nahif un jiddan. In this picture, we see a very weak person. So I will write slasa here. In this way, you will do this question, and then we will proceed to the next one. Again, he is asking you to listen. Then put the number in the appropriate box. So again, you will open the next video this time. This one probably. 
again you can decrease the speed from here if you want if you feel the need for it التدريب الثاني استمع ثم ضع الرقم في المربع المناسب واحد هل انت جوعان هل انت جوعان are you hungry نعم انا جوعان جدا so هل انت جوعان are you hungry he is replying yes i am very hungry so in this picture we see a very hungry person so here we will write واحد next اثنان اين الشاي الشاي على المائدة أين الشاي؟ Where is the tea? الشاي على المائدة and the tea is on the dining sheet or dining table. In this wow, we see this thing, so I will write إثنان in the wow. Sorry, I need to write it in Arabic, not in English. ماذا تفضلين من الفاكهة؟ أفضل العنب. ماذا تفضلين من الفاكهة؟ أفضل العنب. So تفضلين من she is asking to a female. So here we see a female and it is fruit has it has fruit as well. So this is the one. Next we will play the next video. التدريب الثالث استمع إلى السؤال ثم ضع الرقم في المربع المناسب واحد ماذا تأكل من الطعام so, ماذا تأكل من الطعام what do you eat from the food so I think let me see which one is appropriate for this For this picture, I think for this question, this picture will be best because here we have food. So I will write Wahid here. Mazata Kulu, what do you eat from the food? Next. Ma was nook. Ma was nook. What is your weight? So in this picture, we ask this person what is your weight? Talata. Mazat Shahid. Maza to Shahin, what do you see? So what are you watching? So this one is best for this. In this way you will do this one as well. Atadribu Rabi is the meal al Jumal listen to the sentences Submanda Alamata Sahiya fil Muramba al Munasib then put the check mark in the appropriate box. We have two options in all of them. So we need to select the right answer. No, I think we have got this one. Yes. التدريب الرابع. استمع إلى الفقرة ثم ضع علامة صحيح في المربع المناسب. هذا بيت عمر. الساعة الواحدة الأسرة في غرفة الطعام هذه وجبة الغداء على المائدة طعام كثير عمر يأكل السمكة ويشرب الشاي وزينب تأكل اللحمة وتشرب الماء Now if you feel that speed is fast, then play it again and this time click on settings and click on playback speed and click on this. This will decrease the speed, then you will easily understand it. 
هذا بيت عمر الساعة الواحدة الأسرة في غرفة الطعام So here we are talking about whole family and the family is in the غرفة الطعام which means this picture So we will put the check mark on this picture Next هذه وجبة الغداء على المائدة طعام كثير عمر يأكل السمكة So Umar Yaakulu Samak. Umar is eating fish. In the bar we see a fish. So I will put the check mark on bar. Wa yashrabu shaya. Now in both pictures we see cup. I think this one is better for the tea. Maybe. So you will put check mark like this. And in this way you will do this question. Then we have Al-Kalam Tabadda lil hiwara ma zameeli kama fil misal Al misal ma za ta'akulu fil ghada What do you eat in the lunch? Aakulu al-laham I eat the meat Wa ma za tashrabu And what do you drink? Ashrabu al-shai I drink tea Basically we need to ask two questions What do you eat? And what do you drink? So you will hide the example Ma za ta'akulu fil fatur What do you eat? eat in the breakfast he will say aakulu dajaj i eat chicken wa maza tashrabu and what do you drink ashrabu al qahwa i drink coffee then you will ask maza taakulu fil asha what do you eat in the dinner aakulu salata i eat salad wa maza tashrabu and what do you drink ashrabu al halib I drink the milk. In this way, you will do it without looking at the example. Then, maza tatulbu. What would you like? What would you order? Baz samaki min fazlik. Some fish, please. Haza hu was samak. Here it is the fish. Shukran. Thanks. Here, basically, a waiter will come to you and he will ask you what would you like, and you will order him something, and then he will give it to you, and then you will thank him. So again you will uh, hide the example and you will uh, ask what would you like or what would you order Maza tatlubu and you will say Baad al faqihati min fadlik Some fruit please He will give you the fruit by saying Hazihi hi yal faqiha In the example we were using Haza huwa because samak is masculine but faqiha is feminine so you will say Hazihi hi yal faqiha then you will say uh, shukran thanks then again the waiter will ask you maza tatlubu what would you order what would you like you will say baad al qahwati min fazlik some coffee please then he will give you coffee by saying hazihi hi al kahwa here it is the coffee then you will say shukran thanks hal tashrabu shaya do you drink the tea la ufaddil al kahwa no i prefer the coffee هل تأكل اللحم؟ Do you eat meat? لا أفضل السمك. No, I prefer fish. So let's again you will hide the example. Your friend will ask you, Do you eat rice? هل تأكل الأرز? And you will uh, reply, لا أفضل الخبز. No, I prefer bread. Then your friend will ask, هل تشرب الحليب? Do you drink milk? And you will reply, لا أفضل الماء. No, I drink. No, I prefer water. You can skip this question. Ain al ghada, where is the lunch? Al ghada wal al maida, the lunch is on the dining table, dining sheet. Ana jawan ujidna, I am very hungry. Ladaina do you? We have guest. Man who? Walidi wa walidati wa jaddi. My father and my mother and my grandmother. Sorry, my grandfather. So this dialogue is little long, so you can just write it's uh, and write the English of it here, and then of course you need to do it without looking at the Arabic example. So what are the question? Where is the lunch? I am very hungry. These two question will be probably same for all of them, 
and rest of the thing will be according to the picture so the first person will ask Ain al -fatu, where is the breakfast the second person will say al fatu al al that the breakfast is on the dining sheet what was the next question and okay he will say i am very hungry ana jawanu jiddan he will say the other person will say ladaina duyuf we have guests then he will ask who man he will say akhi wa ukhti ammi my brother my sister and my auntie my uncle sorry again you will do like this ainal asha al asha wal al maida ana jawanu jiddan i am very hungry the other person will say Ladaina do you? We have guest. So first person will ask man who. Second person will say ammi wa ammati wa jaddati. My uncle, my auntie, and my grandmother. At the dribu sadis, ajibadil asilatit tali answer the following question. Now these questions are for male. If you are female, you need to change these questions little bit. You. So the female question student will say taakulina will write the question taakulina taakulina so male will write the question directly but female will write like this in all of these she will write taakulina instead of wasnuka she will write wasnuki instead of tufadilu she will write tufadilina instead of tashrabu she will write tashrabina Anta anti and Jawan instead of female we write Jaw uh, Hal anti instead of Samin she will write Samina Then everyone will answer according to their self Kamajbutan Takulu fil Yom how many meals do you eat in the day? The second person will answer Akulu Salasa Wajabat I eat three meals. Maza Takulu fil Gada what do you eat in the lunch? Aakulu samaka Maza taakulu fil fatur What do you eat in the breakfast? Aakulu dajaja Maza taakulu fil asha Aakulu aruz Ma waznuka What is your weight? Wazni tisuna kilan In this way your answer are these questions You can skip this page This is not important then here you will need to join the sentence with the appropriate picture. So the first sentence al al maida the fruit is on the dining sheet. So dining table you can see as well. You need to join like this. Tahir Yasharbu Asir al Inab Tahir is drinking the grape juice. So join it with grape juice. Ad Duyufu Figur Fatil Jus. The guests are in the living room. So, you will. I think you need to join it with this picture, and the first one will be with this one. G. There is a mistake here, so we can fix it. In this way, you need to join them. So, you will join all of them, and then. Silbaina Suwali will join the question and the answer again. You will join. This Ain al Kahwa, where is the coffee? Al Kahwa, Al Al Maida. Come, Wajibat and Takulu fil Yom Akulu Salasa Wajibat. In this way, you will do it. At the Dribul Khamis, fifth exercise, Ikra al Fikra, Summa Ajibanila Sila. Read the paragraph, then answer the questions. I think, let me check the duration of the video. It is 24 minutes. So, I think 24 minutes are enough. Next time, inshallah. We will continue from this page and for the homework this homework you will find it in homework number 13 so you will do it in homework number 13 you can submit it in any of those homeworks it does not matter just submitting is important so if you have any question feel free to ask me on my whatsapp you can ask me in the comments as well Ma salama.